All right, the O15L, just wanted an update on this saw. Um, it was making a loud whining sound. That ended up being the oiler um, was, uh, it was all hollowed out, wallowed out in, inside of there. And so I guess it really wasn't oiling good. I found one online, used one and it works really good. I went ahead and um, put this um, little module in here to uh, replace the points. So I just totally took the points out, um, threw the wires up through there, up through the handle over here, and attached it to the ground here. The best place so I, I could find where I wouldn't have to um, screw into there. The um, Archer blade. Um, so it's oiling good. Um, changed out the um, little spring that I had. It's got 16 to 1 mix, non ethanol fuel, and oh, and also I changed out the spark plug wire. I got uh, one from a, um, a lawnmower and just strung it up through there. And um, the uh, the fuel line that they sell for this, uh, which I had gotten, um, supposed to seal in the tank there, and but it didn't. So, um, put uh, not even I didn't even put a steel kind of a fuel filter in it, just one of those um, cotton type filters. Um, and I used the Echo two hole um, grommet, the one that's uh, a pretty decent size. And so one of the lines goes from that, just using the, the regular yellow um, yellow line, goes up to the carburetor. The other one, just so that I could feel it, and it probably needed one anyways, I put that vent that Echo uses, and just it vents about right here. And, um, and then for the air filter, I just have that foam, like a, some of that foam um, type filter that's used. And so I'll show you, it cuts good. The RPMs are just really good and has good power and cut through. And I'll show you. RPM. That chain might be a little tight. Lunge cut right here.
and the temperature it's a uh, it's very good temperature not hot to the touch or anything like that so just about the only thing I didn't do is change out the oil seals in this saw um, I'd like to change out the oil seals but the uh, the oil seals are they're two different sizes in there it's the it's the small oil seal that's on a lot of these small saws from this era the early 80s late 70s and they're just hard to find so um, I'm trying to locate the actual size of them so that I can order them cheap um, but a lot of times it really isn't even a problem with these old saws do the the thick gas mix the thick thick oil mixture in the gas so this one's good good to go working really good